More weather coverage coming up soon, but we have a late-breaking story tonight of national importance. The January 6th committee has publicly released its final report on the investigation of the Capitol riots, accusing former President Trump of a conspiracy to overturn his electoral loss. Willie James Inman reports from Washington. After a nearly 18-month investigation, the House Select Committee on the January 6th Capitol attack has released its final report. I think you'll see that it's very comprehensive, that it's thorough in its presentation. The report comes just days after the panel unanimously voted to recommend the Department of Justice pursue four criminal charges against former President Donald Trump. There are nine eyes and zero no's. The recommended charges relate to his alleged efforts to overturn the results of the 2020 election. They include obstruction of an official proceeding and conspiracy to defraud the United States. The final report is the result of a huge effort by the bipartisan committee. It conducted about 1,200 interviews and collected more than a million documents. On Thursday, the committee released a transcript of the testimony from Cassidy Hutchinson, the former aide to Mark Meadows. It comes a day after the committee released dozens of other witness testimonies, including Jeffrey Clark, a senior official in the Trump Justice Department, and for John Eastman, a former law professor. Trump maintains he did nothing wrong on January 6th and has repeatedly called the committee's investigation a witch hunt. Willie James Inman, CBS News, Capitol Hill. House Republicans issued their own report focused on security failures on January 6th. They blame Capitol Police leadership and House Speaker Nancy Pelosi for not protecting the Capitol. And they say Capitol Police did not receive proper training to handle a situation like the attack. 